Assalamu alaikum dear friends today in 2020 I am here to explain and telling that how to solve that self so practical in which we will find mean or sample means by using random number table so video is very very interesting I will solve that practical with easiest and conceptual method by using three steps that the step one and that the step two and step three will I will solve that so that steps are very very important for you so don't skip any step because each step is very very uh, beneficial to you so if you want more practical then you can then you can watch the description below the video because I have sent links of other practicals in, in below the video so let's start the lecture so here you have uh, practical is given here you have to remove here using a random number table select 30 samples select 30 samples of size 3 each with replacement from the following data find the mean of sample mean given data here height and number of students which is the frequency so first of all you have to calculate x x is a midpoint x is a x is a midpoint you can easily calculate that very simple simple add them answer then you are by 2 you can easily calculate x midpoint I calculate now 60 uh, 60 plus 62 60 plus 62 answer then divided by uh, 2 you get the value here 61 I will write here 61 that's the next point 63 63 plus 65 answer then divided by 2 you get the value here 64 that's clear and next move 66 plus 68 66 plus 68 answer then divided by 2 you get the value here 67 that's clear very easy and shortcut method 69 69 plus 71 69 answer then divided by 2 we get the value here 70 now moving last value 72 and 74 72 plus 74 answer then divided by 2 you get the value here 73 so i have calculated the x mid point which are very very uh, very very important for you next point next point you have to calculate here cumulative frequency you have to calculate here cumulative frequency so first of all you have to calculate adding that value you have to calculate here smission f adding that value is right again 5 plus 18 plus uh, 42 plus 27 plus 8 adding that value you get the value here 100 so first of all now I'm calculating here cumulative frequency very simple step first of all I write here values 5 just like that that's the method of sorting cumulative frequency very very easy next step 5 plus 18 5 plus 18 you can easily calculate 19 20 23 that's simple next step 23 plus 42 23 plus 42 right here 23 plus 42 we get the value here 65 that's clear and next step is here 65 plus 27 65 plus 27 similarly we get the value here 92 and next 92 plus 8 you get the value here 100 so I am calculating here cumulative frequency so next step is very very important must remember that I will write here assigning number of groups assigning number of groups so that's method for assigning number of groups you have to uh, you have to remember just one trick I'm telling you that that trick is here that's the mission app 100 we will must minus 1 we get the value here 99 we show that the group will made from 0, 0 to 99 you can say that I will make here group of assigning number of group which we will make up to zone 99 so must remember 
टोटल मिशन माइनस वन ऑलवेज फॉर रैंडम नंबर टेबल जस्ट नाइनटी नाइन विच शो दैट डैट इज अ टू डिजिटल फॉर्म डैट इज अ टू डिजिटल फॉर्म बिकॉज इज आर टू डिजिट नाउ नेक्स्ट मूवी द नेक्स्ट स्टेप आई एम मेकिंग द अस्टैंडिंग नंबर ऑफ ग्रुप मूवे फाइव एल जी फाइव माइनस वन वी विल गेट एयर फोर वेट सिंपल जस्ट सिंपल फाइव माइनस वन वी गेट द वैल्यू एयर फोर यस क्लियर नेक्स्ट स्टेप डेट वैल्यू विल बी हेयर यू कैन राइट एयर जीरो फाइव डेट क्लियर नेक्स्ट ट्वेंटी थ्री माइनस वन सिमिलरली यू गेट द वैल्यू एयर ट्वेंटी टू डेट क्लियर यू कैन से डेट ट्वेंटी थ्री माइनस वन वी गेट एयर ट्वेंटी टू डेट क्लियर नेक्स्ट ट्वेंटी थ्री विल बी हेयर डेट नेक्स्ट सिक्सटी फाइव माइनस वन विल बी सिक्सटी फोर डेट द मेथड ऑफ असाइनिंग नंबर ऑफ ग्रुप जस्ट फोर डेट जस्ट सिक्सटी फाइव विल बी हेयर नाइंटी टू माइनस वन विल बी हेयर नाइंटी वन डेट क्लियर डेट नाइंटी टू विल बी हेयर हंड्रेड माइनस वन विल बी नाइंटी नाइन सो आई हैव मेड द टेबल ऑफ असाइनिंग नंबर ऑफ ग्रुप जीरो जीरो टू नाइंटी नाइन which have i have already told you that so i hope that you have cleared the first step which was very very easy next step is second step i have already told you that you have to make here right here 30 samples so i have made there 30 samples serial numbers 1 to 30 now move to the next step i will i am writing is that in here from random number table samples of size 3 two digits because these are Two digits. So for that section, you have to use random number table by book Sher Muhammad Choudhury. All right here. So here, for that section, for that random number table, for getting that values of two digital form, you have to use random number table. You have to use random number. टेबल बाय बुक शेर मोहम्मद चौधरी बाय बुक शेर मोहम्मद चौधरी बाय बुक शेर मोहम्मद चौधरी एंड विच द पेज नंबर इज ऑफ दिस इज द चैप्टर नंबर फोर्टीन पेज नंबर इज हेयर ए so that by using that table i have already written that values of two digital form 536635 up to so that's clear next step is here corresponding height corresponding height we shows that x we show that here must remember here 53 53 shows that i will search that value in that group assigning number of group very simple 53 must remember that 53 Is occur in that type of group. In that type of group, that corresponding value is x. That corresponding value is x. So right here, sixty-seven. I am writing here five threes before sixty-seven. That's clear. Next sixty-three. I search that sixty-three is available in that group. So that corresponding value is x sixty-seven. I am writing here sixty-seven. That's clear. Uh, similarly, thirty-five. Thirty-five is available in that group. That corresponding value is sixty-seven. I write here sixty-seven. And last step, sixty-sixty-three, just like and ninety-eight. Ninety-eight. Ninety-eight is available in that section. That's clear. That corresponding value of x is seventy-three. So I write it here ninety-three before seventy-three and zero-two. Zero-two is available in that section. 02 is available in that section so that corresponding value is 61 so i write it from 02 to that 61 and similarly you can do it himself you can take the screenshot of that that's very very easy next step in here you have to calculate x bar x bar is mission x over n you have to add 67 plus 67 plus 67 Answer then divided by three because these are three number of values one two three divided by three you get the value as sixty seven and just like you do that you can easily calculate x bar so I hope that you have clear concepts in that how can we solve step one how can we solve step two now last step is remaining which is third step in which we will find mean of samples mean so don't skip third step I am moving here third step.
थर्ड स्टेप स्टेप नंबर थर्ड स्टेप नंबर थर्ड इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट विच इज द मेन रिजल्ट ऑफ दैट लेक्चर स्टेप थ्री स्टेप थ्री इज वेरी वेरी इजी इज स्टेप थ्री आई वो राइट हेयर एक्स बार सिंपल दैस आई वो राइट हेयर टैली and that's a right here frequency so for x bar you have to move here x bar so that's why these are when written values in a repetition form you will write this values in sequence form you can write here 6 7 i will write here 6 7 6 8 and just like that the values here sorry 6 5 6 5 6 5 or uh, 6 5 is the shortest value so i will write here uh, 65 so i write here from smallest value to a uh, greatest value i will write here smallest value is in and section is 65 so i will write here smallest value 65 then moving ahead 66 next next value is here 60 or uh, 60 67 i will write here 68 69 next next value is 68 69 and next 70 And seventy value. Next value is there. Seventy as seventy ninety values. Seventy is the last value. So seventy is the last value. So that I've calculated x bar. Tally is very very easy. I will search that value sixty five. Sixty five. I will that value search it in that group. I will write here tally. Tally shows that just like one two three four. That is the tally. That is the tally. Very easily you can easily calculate. 65, 65. I count that values in here. Which time it repeats? How much time it repeats? 65, 65 is there. One, one time. One, uh, two. Why is that here? One, two. Next move here. Uh, two, uh, three times. That's repeated here three times. So right here, one, two, three. So frequency is the total. I will write here three. Next will be the sixty six. Sixty six. I write here sixty six. Sixty six. Sixty six. Ah, uh, sixty six. Just one time. One. Ah, uh, one, two, three. Sixty six. Repeat it three times. So I write here one, two, three. Here three times. Next sixty seven. Sixty seven. Sixty seven. Repeat here one, two, ah, uh, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, nine times repeat. So I'm right here, just like that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's right here. The combination value here nine. Next will be here sixty-eight. Sixty-eight is written here. Just like value one. Right here one two. Next two ah uh, sixty-eight three, four, and next here five. Six, ah, uh, six values. So right here, values just like that. One, two, three, four, five, six. So right here, six value. Next one is sixty-nine. Sixty-nine is the very very next section. One, two, and next one again. One, two, three, and uh, four. Next value four, ah, uh, just four values. So right here, one, two, three, four. So I put here four values. That's here. Next one, last step is here seventy. Seventy repeats in down. Uh, One time, one, two, three, four. Four times repeat seventy. So right here, one, two, three, four dash. So I hope that you have cleared the point. Next step will be I will write here submission app. Submission app you easily calculate three three nine three three nine. Ah, uh, sorry, three three six six nine six. I write here six plus nine plus ah uh, six plus nine plus six plus Four four will be eight. So I get the value here twenty nine. So submission app is here twenty nine. Now next step is here. You have to calculate probability of x bar, which is equal to f over submission app. That's clear. And last step will be here x bar probability of x bar. That's clear. So main point is here. You have to calculate mean of sample mean. So next move is that probability of x bar three divided by twenty nine. Three divided by twenty nine. Three divided by twenty nine. That's simple. Nine divided by twenty nine. Six divided by twenty nine. I have focus question. I have. I am keeping a very easy and shortcut method. 
4 over 29 and 4 over 29. We can easily calculate dash value transmission probability of x bar 29 divided by 29 will be 1. So must remember that sum of probability always equal to 1, which shows that your practical is correct. Must remember. Sum of probability must be 1. Next time, last step is here. X bar probability of x bar. So x bar is here. And that's the probability of x bar. You can easily calculate that value. Multiply that value. You can write here 65 multiplied by 3 divided by 29. Calculate here 65 multiplied by 3. Uh, we get the value here 195 divided by 29. That's simple. 66 multiplied by 3. 66 multiplied by 3. You get the value here 198 divided by 29. Next 67 multiplied by 9. 67 multiplied by 9, we get the value here 603. 603 divided by 29. Next is 68 by 6. 68 multiplied by 6, we get the value here 408. 408 divided by 29. And next uh, 69. 69 multiplied by 4. 69 multiplied by 4, we get the value here 276. 276 divided by 29. And last value is 70 multiplied by 4. 70 multiplied by 4, we get the value here 280. 280 divided by 29. Now, adding that value, you get here submission x bar for value of x bar, which is mu x bar, which is equal to mu x bar. So, must remember that mean of sample mean, mean of sample mean is just in reality is mu x bar is equal to submission x bar for value of x bar. Must remember. Mean of sample is attack. Mean of sample is mu x bar is equal to submission x bar for value of x bar. Now, I think that value you can easily get the value here submission x bar for value of x bar. So, I, I think that value you can write here 195 plus 198 plus uh, 603. Next, plus 408 plus uh, 276. Next, write that value here 280. Adding that value, you get the value here 1960. Value here 1960 divided by 29. So that is the answer of that mean of sample mean. So I hope that you have cleared the three step. That three step is very very easy. You can easily do uh, usually do it yourself. Thanks for watching the video. If you like this video, then can you must subscribe to my YouTube channel. Must press bell icon button for gaining notification of my new lecture and new practicals. Goodbye.